Alright YouTube, so this is a fresh bucket of pasteurized hay with some mycelium in it. I just broke open one of our hay spawns, but we're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight total buckets from this one bucket here check it out boom super white frosty my sin it's healthy the top looks so good I should have started this video from the beginning but yeah I want to apologize about the last video here goes the hay we're using some pasteurized hay we just do it in a pan over here Boom. On the grill. Propane stove. Yep. And that's how we do it. Those pans there. There's some more distilled hay. Or not distilled, sorry. <laughs> Pasteurized hay. There's how we dry it right here. A little basket. Or let it cool down, I should say. It's still not dry. But we just get, when we get done, we put it in there. And so that's the process. But yeah, so <clears throat> we had the, here goes one of the bags we inoculated the other day. It's doing good. Nice. Sweet. And they're just outside in the summer, or springtime I should say. And we got some doing their thing over here. Looks pretty nice. But anyways, back to what I was talking about. Um, <clears throat> uh, we had a... Um, a video we put out for eating cigarette buds or whatever, have training our mycelium radical mycology, and we'll be continuing that. But we had an issue with our grain spawns, so we just postponed the project. And I was giving you an update with this video, all right? But yeah, let me show you the process. So we get the hay, let me put the bucket closer. Sorry, I need to get a tripod and make one. Alright, grab about a nice healthy handful of hay. And peel a nice thin layer off. I'm gonna put that right in the bucket. Mmm, my same smells so good. Oh crap, I'm getting a shoelace in there. It's all good. So it won't hurt this. These are oysters. Yeah, and the weather's been decently warm out here. But in the night it still gets pretty chilly. So the oysters are doing great. You just pack it in there. Another layer. There's a little hair there. But yeah. I don't want to bore you guys too much with me working. I just wanted you to see the process. I'm going to do the cigarette video soon. We got the book Radical Mycology as well. And so we've been studying up making progress as you guys can see doing it big almost <laughs> kind of so yeah uh you guys have fun out there and grow some mushrooms definitely try out oysters if your area if they can grow in your area it's super easy it's like one of the easiest things you can ever grow so give it a shot you guys all right have a good day